a very important thing. This cat has undergone a spay procedure. She is on gas anesthesia at the moment, and this is a proper cardiac stethoscope that I am having. And I am auscultating. I am basically assessing the quality of the heart sound because what I have here is a makeshift esophageal stethoscope. This is an ordinary stethoscope and this is a Rhinz tube that I have connected over here and this has a radio opaque bead inside it has a radio opaque line it has opening so that it doesn't get clogged with saliva and I have measured it right from the canine to the heart space and believe me I am hearing the same quality of sounds that I am having with the cardiac stethoscope we know how difficult it is to get a proper esophageal stethoscope but necessity is the mother of invention and here we have our own uh, esophageal stethoscope. I am very happy to pass on the design. It's very simple. It's a basic stethoscope frame. I have removed the diaphragm, connected a Ryan's tube, measured it, duplicated it, make sure the anesthesia is uh, adequate. Uh, the, the laryngeal folds are uh, sensitive. I, mean, so I have had a lignocate. I have a secure airway. So the chances of affecting anything is literally nil over here. I've measured it and I put it in and here we are, we have a successful esophageal stethoscope to all my dear veterinary community or veterinary community across the world. Thank you so much.